how to create a subdomain if you already have a domain then how you are going to create a new domain to completely host a new website out there so this is my website as you are seeing here you can hire me from this page and I have already created so many blocks useful blocks which can help you to find out currently I am working on Magento 2 so you can find very useful blogs over there like uh, my latest blog how to install Magento so cut out there uh, mm, let's head up to what we are going to do we are going to create a new subdomain for this website webarchers.com this is my main domain so to create a subdomain just log in to your cpanel and uh, scroll a bit down under the database below the database you will see the domain section and here here you will found subdomains options so just click here so what is the difference between domain and subdomain so a subdomain is like a another host for your websites and uh, without changing your domain name Th this will help uh, when you are trying to host multiple websites on the same domain and you don't want to uh, create a new domain or buy a new domain or purchase a hosting so that's why we create a new subdomain so let's say uh, we are what we are going to name our subdomain let's say uh, I'm going to give this a name mage2 so whatever you will put it here put here this will be the prefix of this domain so the domain name would be mage2.webarchers.com so this will be the complete subdomain address <coughs> what we are going to creating here so uh, after doing this just hit the create button and the message appears make two dot webarches.com has been created so just go back there and in the subdomain list you can see maze2.webarchers.com and <coughs> just head up to the main home page section and here I'm going to visit my file manager and let's say if our inside the public HTML folder let's see if our newly created domain yes here mage2 so just for testing I'm going to put here a page name index.php so for this I'm go opening my code editor uh, just stay with me guys taking a bit longer so I'm just talk type HTML and here head section you can put anything you can put a complete website here for now I'm just putting here few 
let me save it so it will be more faster and put it on the desktop page with the name desktop html save it i guess i can save it in desktop html already been saved sorry title title I'm putting here my first subdomain and in the body section I'm going to create a h1 tag which says hello my new subdomain I saved it and I'm going to upload this here from my desktop this is the file I'm going to upload it here in desktop.html so what we did I'm going to summarize just log into your cPanel and scroll down until you find the domain section and hit the domain subdomain button sorry and create the whatever name you want to create just type in this section as I have typed mage2.webarchers.com and uh, simply create it now I'm going to visit this please note that any subdomain you create any subdomain you create will take few time uh, it's uh, maybe one hour or two hour maybe four hour or maybe five or ten minutes to get response until uh, before this if you type the subdomain and try to visit this you probably see an error but no we have created the subdomain 